Hey guys, what's up, Gemini? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, and the obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. So this could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with. So flip it how you need to. Also, keep in mind this is a general reading. So take what's yours. Holy Libra, be mine. If it does resonate for you, please make sure to like and subscribe below. If not, make sure you check out your moon and rising sign. Alright, we need a future for the gems. Daydreaming. Looking at pictures. Alright, if you guys would like to contact me for a personal reading, you can find that information below as well. Alright. Cool. Alright, cool. Alright, show me the five of wands. Those look like there's some some type of feelings. Yeah. See, somebody's fighting for their feelings. They're competing for them. Um, maybe doing it in a, in a crazy way or somebody could have been deceitful. In a crazy way, I mean a, a particular way, a planned out way. Um, or somebody, like I said, could have been deceitful. But there is feelings here. Your wish fulfillment, your, mis your emotional fulfillment. Yeah, somebody wants a reconciliation. There's feelings all over this. And somebody is, is willing to fight for it. It may feel like you have competition. But somebody's going hard for their emotions here. So you could have met someone while you were out. You could have recently started dating. King of Swords. You could have been dealing with a, um, an air sign. Could have walked away. Or kind of turned off emotions here. It, it feels like. There's romantic feelings all over this, so. Could have been an argument between friends as well. It's a general reading. Okay, so this King of Swords is worried. So this could be you. Again, it's interesting because uh, it's like somebody's worried there's competition or a third party around a situation. Like they want to pounce towards something. But see, we have the five and the seven of swords trying to peek out here. So somebody's been healing from some sneaky stuff. Or could be up to some sneaky stuff. But somebody is really worried that there's competition. And it's like they want to come straight towards you because there's the empress. And that new opportunity. So you could be dealing with the Taurus. Somebody does want to come forward and balance things out. But they're so worried that... There's someone else, or you are. Show me this nine of cups. Well, I don't know who wouldn't be worried when you got feelings like that. That's a lot of feelings. This is wish fulfillment, emotional fulfillment. I mean, this is for real pure feelings. I don't want to take that many. Show me this nine of cups. The Knight of Wands. Somebody definitely could have been a player, but it more so feels like um, it could have been an age difference. Um, yeah, somebody's headed straight for commitment, like barreling quickly. It's happening quickly. The Knight of Wands is the fastest move of night in the day. The Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Energy. Um, there's that Empress again. So, the Queen of Pentacles, like I said, is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. But next to this Ten of Pentacles, this is stability, abundance, um, a very secure, stable, grounded energy. This person definitely does not want to lose you. 
Looks like you're on the fast track to something very stable here. Now, if we have the Empress pop out over here, uh, that's definitely going to change things. All right, so these keep wanting to pop out. The Death of Scorpio energy and the Nine of Wands. So somebody could have blocked the situation. This really is intense for someone. There could have been... Okay, that's what it is. So... Somebody's angry. This could have been a, a marriage, a long-term commitment, or maybe somebody wants that. But somebody is, is, is holding back with their emotions. And it's probably because of anger, because of pain. Because we have the nine of wands. So somebody, this is wound a warrior. You've been through a lot with this situation. You've been tired, wore out with it. But it looks like somebody is trying to, like, bring it back. Like, take it back to a stable place. Show me this outcome for Gemini. Because the Page of Cups is there. That is romantic feelings all day. It is just a page, but the Ace of Wands is there. The Page of Wands. This could involve children. And that King of Pentacles. So now you're matching energies, right? You have your divine counterpart. There's an offer to stabilize things. There really are like romantic feelings here. With that Page of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles, it's, it's a lot of stability, a lot of working together to build something stable and long-lasting. New cycles are beginning here. Communication is coming. This could be job opportunities. It looks like an apology or just wanting to talk because this person does love you. So make sure that you look at things from all angles. If this has been a stuck position, it's no longer stuck. I mean, a stuck situation. Somebody is finally trusting. Use your intuition moving forward. That could be traveling, moving. Show me the Ace of Wands. Please. The Devil. Temptation. Capricorn Energy. Normally with the devil and the king of pentacles, I would say greed. This could be somebody who let you down in the past. It could be like a toxic situation, but I mean, it looks like they're trying to rebuild here. This could also be like a job offer with a major firm, but the empress is here um, with the five of cups. So it feels like this is somebody who let you down before. Again, with the Empress and the Ace of Wands, you may be starting a family. She's about fertility, romance, that type of thing. So there is something new here that you're passionate about. But it looks like um, for some of us, it's a job opportunity. Or you could work with this person. And that's why I cause so much stress. But temptation is here. Opportunities are here. Communication and like actually talking about those feelings. There's that five of swords again. So four and the five of swords. So probably after a time of, of quietness here. So look at things from all angles. Trust your intuition because in some this is temptation. Show me the devil. Can, can we trust this? Can Gemini trust this? Yeah, see? Okay. This could be a Taurus, Leo, this somebody from your past. Could be a marriage, something like that. The Queen of Swords is your energy. This makes you incredibly happy. Let's get advice. I feel like if there was any lies or, you know, something like that, somebody was going to try to clear it up. All right, advice for Gemini for this opportunity that's coming towards on this person. I feel like it's more like this person doesn't want to let you go. You got deception. Someone's wearing a false self mask. It feels like there's more to that devil 
And remember that can go on either side. You got engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. You also got soulmate. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes, this is your soulmate. And you got codependency. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. So that could be the cause of the devil. With the devil and the hangman here, um, sometimes we can escape reality, um, you know, through alcohol, drugs, that type of thing. So it could be the general reading, so not in all situations. Trust. The situation is calling for you to have faith. You also got finances and career. Financial issues are affecting your love life right now. So you definitely may be a little, it may be hard to figure out. It's almost like this person may feel like you're untouchable, like they can't get to you. Um, maybe they feel like you're out of their league or um, maybe you're highly intuitive or, you know, you read cards or something like that. So this person may worry about what you know. Um, this person can't let you go though or vice versa. And someone may be difficult to figure out, but definitely trust your intuition, okay? All right, Gemini, here comes the communication. All right, hope it helped, hope it resonated. If so, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys would like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below as well. You guys take care, and I'll see you next time. Bye.